Hi, I'm Eddie Fitzsimmons. I'm your Washington Realtors Legal Hotline lawyer. And this video is one in our series regarding busting industry myths. And perhaps not coincidentally, you will also find a class in our course catalog entitled Busting Industry Myths. So if you're interested in what you hear today, make sure you tune into one of our classes to hear more industry myths that have ruled the day for brokers for many years and gotten lots of brokers in trouble because they believe the myth without understanding that it is in fact a falsehood. So here is our myth for today. All new construction homes come automatically with a one year warranty. The myth says Washington law mandates a one year warranty on all new construction homes. That is not true. However, it is a myth that has been believed not only by brokers, but also by some real estate lawyers and even some new construction home builders. There is no automatic warranty of any length with new construction. The only warranty that comes with new construction is a warranty that the builder gives to the new home buyer. So unless there is an express, a written warranty from the builder to the new home buyer, there is no warranty that comes with new construction. Now you might do a little research on your own and go, that can't be true. I've heard this for years. And if you do that, you might stumble across something called a warranty of habitability and say, aha, she was wrong. There is a warranty of habitability on all new construction. And that is a true statement. But I assure you, a warranty of habitability is not what your buyer thinks they're getting. If you tell them there's a new, a new home warranty with every new construction residence. Because what your buyer thinks, if you tell them that they're getting a warranty with the new construction, they think they've got a claim against their builder or at least the ability to demand that their builder show up again if there's nail pops, you know, where the nails start to work their way slightly out of the wall and it creates a rough surface and somebody needs to pound them in and maybe even repair sheetrock. That's not covered by a warranty of habitability. There's floor squeaks, not covered by a warranty of habitability. There's loose rails, there's missing molding, there's um, flaws in the windows, there's any number of things that might bug your buyer. And they think, well, my broker told me there was a new uh, construction warranty that comes with my home. If there was not a written warranty from the builder, to the buyer, then there is no warranty. So what is a warranty of habitability? It, it literally means that there is a warranty that the property will be habitable. So when might a property not be habitable? One, one, one example was when the outer decks literally fell off the outside of the house when somebody stand, stood on them. It was a condo building. And if the, if the decks won't support the weight of a person, those decks are not habitable and it impacted the warranty or it triggered a warranty of habitability in that circumstance. So in order to trigger a warranty of habitability, the property literally has to be uninhabitable at least to some extent. So all of those little complaints that bug buyers in their year, first year of home ownership, they think I bought a brand new house. I shouldn't have to put up with these irritations. Well, then they need a new home warranty because without a written warranty, they've got nothing. So don't tell them they do. And if they want a warranty, please don't uh, read it and assure them that it's going to cover their concerns. Instead, advise the buyer to seek legal counsel for assistance in reviewing any new home warranty proposed by their builder. If you want to hear about some more myths, tune into one of our classes. And if you have any questions for me about this topic or any other, please visit the legal hotline at our website, warealtor.org, and follow the links to ask me a question. Thank you for being a Washington Realtors member.